Oh, moving on to Kaduna State, a Kaduna-based cleric has called for national prayers as a panacea to the challenges facing the country. Pastor Emmanuel Simon of the Blessed Embassy International said this during the first Sunday service for 2022. He lamented the high level of insecurity, banditry and kidnapping for ransom among others, urging government to intensify efforts to reduce the scourge. Some of the worshippers expressed joy seeing the first Sunday, hoping the new year will usher in new blessings. <laughs> Insecurity, when it comes, is, is a work that everybody has to put his hand on the deck. Everybody needs to be security conscious. And I thank God for what the government are doing. They are doing their best. And we keep praying as a clergyman. All we need to do is to keep praying, pray for the president, pray for the governor and the House of Senate, and believe God will bring change, our desired change. Because I'm seeing, the Bible says, surely there shall be an end, and the expectation of the righteous shall not be cut up. There will be an end to this one. We also pray for our nation, Nigeria, that God should bring us together. And also, God should restore back the glory of this nation. Pray for wisdom, started from the president to the last person. And also pray that the good luck will continue to see us through in this nation. My prayer in 2022 is um, for us to grow bigger in this church, for Nigeria to rise up, for Nigeria to become God's own, for um, all the killing and batting to stop in all Nigeria, because this country is big, and God deserves all our praise. I really thank God for today. We are blessed. God has been doing many things in our life, and we really thank God for you what God has been doing. In this year, 2022, whatever we put our hand into, God will do it for us. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.